Alcorn joins us now. Cody, you were in Savannah last night. You've moved to Bullock County near Statesboro where there's an issue with a breached dam there. That's right, Chris. Take a look right behind me. This area, Little Creek, is actually closed right now due to the fact that there has been a dam break about a mile up, but you can see the crews here. The other issue is power outages because of the wind and rain. Look how high this water is. People keep walking up to us from nearby homes saying they have never seen the water this high. Some of them living here 30 plus years. Now take a look. I was mentioning that dam. We have some video from Simmons Mill Pond. Again, that's about a mile up off Highway 46. This is the dam that broke overnight. It's about a 200 acre pond that is spilling downstream and that is the concern from emergency management here in South in, uh, in Georgia here in Bullock County as well that the stream that's going down is going to start flooding homes and businesses miles downstream and this is why take a look now this is just off the road look how fast this water is moving right now under this bridge. We've seen trees coming down since we have been out here. And again, this is all coming from that dam about a mile upstream at Simmons Mill Pond here in Bullock County. So emergency management here in Georgia telling everyone downstream along I-16 to be on alert and to be careful. And again, it goes to show you the rain still coming down. It's still a concern. This rain expected to continue until Friday. They've already seen nine plus inches here in Bullock County. Cody Alcorn, 11 Alive News.